I'm Catherine Tickell and I just want to tell you a little bit about this instrument, the Northumbrian small pipes. And they're a member of the bagpipe family and one of the things that's fascinating about bagpipes is that at some point or another pretty much every country in the world has had its own particular version of this instrument. So these are the Northumbrian version and like most bagpipes they have the three um, obvious elements, the chanter, the drones and the bag. Uh, but the Northumbrian pipes and some other pipes as well, the Irish ones and Scottish small pipes, the, we have the bellows as well and the bellows provide the air. So the air goes in through that little valve there and you work them with your elbow and the air comes out of that tube and then into the bag through that connecting tube. So the bag is the air reservoir. So underneath this velvet cover that it's made of leather. Oh, actually, maybe the zip's broken, so you can actually see that coming through there. Um, so it's made of leather, which is airtight. It's treated so it's airtight. And then you squeeze, and the sound comes out. And there's two bits that make the sound. There's the chanter, and the chanter plays the tune. And the crucial thing about Northumbrian pipes is that the end of the chanter is closed. It's solid, so you can't get any air flowing through. So when all your fingers are down, which is the default option, um, then the silence. So you, it's a closed fingering system. So you lift one finger, put it down, lift the next. So that's your basic notes. And then these little extra keys are all for low notes, high notes, sharps and flats. And there's quite a few of those. I've got 16 extra notes on this set of pipes. And then there's the drones. So I'll just put one drone on. So there's one. And that's just like the background. It goes on all the time. You tune them by pulling the tubes in and out. I'll put another one on. Not in tune yet. And let's have one more. I usually use three of the four drones to do the tonic, the octave, and the fifth. So then when you've got that going on, the drones play, the bellows have to keep going, you have to compensate and keep a steady pressure with your left arm as well on the bag, and then you play the tune. Um, and I normally play standing up actually, but I'll have a go. Um, this, I'll play a little bit of a traditional Northumbrian tune called the Bonnie Pit Ladder. Extract, but gives you an idea. <laughs> 